This is an aluminum sheet which is forming a pendulum because it's suspended from this bar. If I pull it back like this, you see that it swings back and forth freely. If I bring this magnet into place though, you see that we can damp out the motion. So now if I pull it back and release, you notice that it dies down fairly quickly. Now notice the aluminum is not attracted to the magnet. And in fact, I can show that there's no trickery here by quickly jerking this magnet out of the way. And you see that that's enough to pull the sheet back and forth. What's going on here? What's going on here is Faraday's law. Faraday's law says that if you change the magnetic field in some region of space, it induces an electric field. Now, if there happens to be a conductor in that region of space, it will induce current. And the current that's indu induced here tries to resist the change in magnetic field. This is known as Lenz's law. If I impose a magnet that has the north end this way, and I impose it like this, I'm increasing the magnetic field in, wait a second, in that direction, away from the camera. So the sheet tries to produce a magnetic field pointing towards the camera. That can be produced by a current that's twirling around this way in a counterclockwise direction. Now the flow of current through that sheet requires energy. Where does the energy come from? It comes from the mechanical energy of the pendulum. And that's why the motion damps out.